What up, though? What up, though? What up, though? This is Friday Soul, and you're in Kaya's Soul Closet. First, I want to say thank you to Jen from Today and Jen's Sewing Room. She's the creator of Hashtag Friday Soul, a place where she gave all the sewers and crafters somewhere to we can just share everything that we love. Okay, so now today's video is about what I was going, what I'm making for the BHM Pattern Challenge. That means Black History Month Pattern Challenge. Okay, I had four patterns that I was going to work on. But we'll get to that at the end of the video. So the pattern that I will be working on, as you can see, she's on my mannequin, is Know Me 2050. I'm doing this dress, but without the neckband part. Okay, so. I did a mock-up. Some of my subscribers, some, some people left messages. I don't know if there's my subscribers or not. I hope they're my subscribers. And thank you, thank you, thank you. They gave me some advice about the pattern. Okay. They said to the, um, this part right here, the high bus, use that measurement for the bodice. Right? So, that's what I did. That's what I did. I didn't do a bust adjustment. What I did was, I graded from the, because this, this, my high bust came out to be the 22. Okay? So, I graded out to the 20 I want to say 26 or 24 I want to say 26 I think 26 to accommodate my girls okay let me show you the mock-up I did a mock-up what I have on now when I tell you y'all came through Okay, I'm telling you, oh my God, that changed the whole, <laughs> that changed my whole game. Oh my goodness. They said, use that and it should be smaller up here. When I tip, hold on, I'm finna show you. Okay, now, look at them shoulders. Can y'all see it? Fitting so cute. Damn. And look, okay, so I basted this dress and I tried this dress on and I said, do a, do a little video, do a little video. And girl, I didn't even do a video. And I'm like, okay. I was surging. I'm like, why you didn't do the video with you with the outfit on? I was so mad because it didn't, it just, the surgery just act up. And I had to sew it on with my sewing machine. I was trying to be like, zoom, 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 and go ahead and go. But do you see this? This is that, this is that dress without the sleeves. Look, let me show you. But I think this fabric is a little, I want to say, I want to say, I don't know. I want to say, I want to say something because in that dress, when I had basted it, it was like all the way in right here. I think that's like a slinkier, slinkier um, fabric than this. This was a nightgown that I couldn't stand because the neck, like, it was just <sighs> uncomfortable. So, but oh my God, look at, you see this? Look. You see it just falling so, when I tell you. This is going to be cute. It's going to be really cute. I put it on. It was really, really cute. And that's what I worked on. What's today? The 23rd. That's what I worked on this week. Not even this week. I want to say Monday and Tuesday. And then today. It was a lot that went on. So, the pattern that I used, that I worked on this week, was 
Nomi 2050. This was it for me, guys. This was so easy to make. If my serger wouldn't have went berserk. It's like every time I change the thread in the serger, it just... I don't know. But, nevertheless, and then I tried to press open my seams. I don't know what's up with this fabric, but it was melting, okay? <laughs> so I had to use the presser cloth, which is just a cut, a piece of white cotton that I have. And that's what I use for the neck band. But I'm like, I'm not even finna do all that with the other stuff. And what I did for the, um, somebody, I don't know who it was, showed me a technique where you just sew one side, the two sides down and just unfold it and it's a cup, like it's, it's, it's together. So I got everything sewn except for the belt. I don't have the belt, um, I don't have the belts, you know, sewn down, but this is the dress right here. It came out really nice. I can't wait to finish it. I can't wait to get it done. This is some beautiful fabric. Oh my gosh. Beautiful. Now, I have so much fabric left. So I'm, I don't know what I'm going to make. I'm thinking I'm going to make a cardigan to go with it. With big, you know, big bell sleeves. Not the, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Or I might make another dress. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Okay, I don't know. And my plans for next week is to finish this dress. I wanted to finish it because it's all sunny and nice. And I was going to take pictures. So my surgeon acted crazy. And so now she need a break. And it felt like I was rushing. And I'm like, just break. Just break. Do your Friday souls. Finish this tomorrow. Go outside and take your pictures. Because I think it's go outside and take picture, you know, weather. Not as far as the wind and how cold it is. But the sun is shining in Detroit. It's still freezing. But the sun is shining. And I think that would be some cute weather. But... I mean, it's some uh, some cute pictures with the sun shining so bright. Yes, this is so nice and comfortable. And I'm wearing this as a nightgown when it's starting in hot. Okay. <laughs> so. Now. That was what I worked on. What I'm going to finish working on is this pattern for next week. And. I should be posting my videos, my uh, vi my my outfit, my garment on, you know, BHM Pattern Ch Challenge, hashtag BHM Pattern Challenge page or whatever you got to do. And to Natita from So Not Your Name page, so you got to tag every, you know, tag both of them. So now the reason why I wasn't able to complete the other three three patterns. It's because, okay, I was sick the week of the ninth, right? I think I did a video because I felt a little better, but I was a little sick, right? So, well, I had a scratchy throat. And then Sunday for the Super Bowl, we had people over here. And... Your girl was done. She was sick again. Don't know if it was COVID or not, but she was sick. So she wasn't able to do anything. I cut this out, I think, the week of the ninth before the Super Bowl. So I didn't do anything that week, right? So I'm like, okay, I'm straight. I can get up. And I'm going to get up this week. Get, you know, the weekend of the 17th. The 17th was a Saturday. I'm going to get up Saturday and finish my dress. But on Friday, my daughter that's pregnant, she had an emergency and she had to go to the hospital. So, 
that was that. And I was, you know, she spent the night, she slept at my house. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> and then she went home Monday. So, Monday, I think I basted everything and did all that. Monday and Tuesday, I basted the dress together. And Wednesday, I found out a good friend of mine had passed away. She had cancer. And it was it was my best friend from, from when I was, you know, I was an adult, but it was like years, years ago. She was my, I have never had a best friend. She was my best friend. And she passed away. And so I haven't really been in a mood to do anything. But I had, I, I, this is something that I want to do. And so I'm like, let me do this. Let me just do this Friday. So get this Friday so out the way so I could um, move on to something else. Okay. So that was the reason why the other three patterns will not be getting done. So this is it. Know me 2050. That's all I got. She almost finished. She will be finished by the 29th. Hopefully, she will be finished by the 26th. So I can go take my picture. She might be finished tomorrow. I don't know. We'll be see. So, with that being said, I really, really, really appreciate you guys for watching. And please comment, like, and subscribe. Tell me what you want to see from my channel. Because I'll be sitting here like, I don't know what the, what to say. Everybody didn't say it. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Everybody did it. But I got a couple of things that I want to do. And I'm just like, I'm just going to go ahead and do it. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to go ahead and do it. It's Black History Month. So we just going to be positive and go ahead and just be. Okay? So that's my plan. Can't wait till the first. Start a whole new month. Start it all over again and just, just keep trying. You know, just trying to stay up and Okay, so it's been a, it's been a, this this has been another month full of heartache and suffering. So that's it. That's all I really have. Thank you guys for coming in. Thanks to all my subscribers and everyone that's watching, and thanks to Jen for giving me this platform to share my thoughts on my garments. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. And hopefully I'll see y'all next week. Y'all stay blessed. Bye.